This video will show you how to embed a YouTube video into your website. Uh, this can be used for just about any website if it's a WordPress site or anything else. In this particular instance, I'm going to be showing you how to embed it into your eEdge website, otherwise known as Market Leader. So you'll have to have already uploaded this video into YouTube or have a YouTube video in mind, and that's a different tutorial. Uh, then you'll be, if you're logged into Gmail, you'll automatically be, automatically be logged in. Uh, YouTube is owned by Google, so you'll use your Gmail password to log into YouTube, or you can just create a new account. You go to Video Manager, and then go to the video that you want to embed, and then you'll open the link to uh, Tools for noobs that I provided below. I like this embedding tool because it provides a lot more options. Uh, and then you'll go and grab that URL at the top of the YouTube page. Go ahead and just copy that. And then you'll paste that into this box here. You'll select whatever options you want. I don't like to show the related videos at the end. Uh, you can even choose color options for menus. Um, in your eEdge website, Market Leader site, you'll have to choose version 1 for the player. And then um, for this particular video, I want it to autoplay because I'm going to be using this video in a video email. And that's another tutorial um, as well. Then we'll hit Generate Code. You'll notice it gives us a preview of what that's going to look like, which is helpful. It has an advertisement down here for them, and that's this this code right here at the end. So you just want to take everything from slash object up. So right from that there up. Okay. And we're going to open up our our website. In this in this case I'm I'm going through Keller Williams, so I'm going to use the plus button here to get to manage eEdge website or if I'm doing my eAgency website I'd go here and that's in section 3.7 is where you edit or add pages so click on eEdge website and once you click in here you will see your your URL for your website right here I'm just gonna go to this URL to show you the different places where you can add this. You can put it on the main page. You can also put it on the cell tab. You can put it on your custom tab. And, and then you can also put it on any of your community serve tabs. In this video, I'm going to put it on one of the community serve tabs. Um, so we'll go, and those those same places are here. Main text is here for your main website. Cell text is where you would put it if you wanted it there. Custom page is right here at the bottom. And then community served are right here. So I'm going to go down and add a community. I'm just going to call it test. And then you'll have to put a zip code in. And then add that zip code. And then right here is where we're going to put whatever text we want to add. You can use the WYSIWYG to do that text. Then you click on HTML. And that's where you're going to grab and copy this code. And you're going to paste that right in here. Go down to the bottom, hit update. And now this is where the video is going to show up in your, in your, on your eEdge site. Go down and hit save. And now I'm going to refresh this page. And I should have a, a new community serve called test. And here it is with the video. Now you'll notice that it put it in this little 100 by 100 window. I'm not sure why eEdge does that. It doesn't like it. It edits the code and changes it, and changes it slightly. But that's easy to fix. We'll just come into here under text, test. Click on the edit button, and we can just grab any of these corners right here and resize that to whatever size we want it to be. OK, 
Okay, so then I'm just going to go back down and hit save. And we'll go back and refresh that and see what that looks like now. And we can keep going back and forth until we get it to this, the exact size that we want it to be. And that's the whole process. Thanks for watching.